Welcome back to Let's Play Faunasphere. Today we're going to do a couple goals in the opulent quarry and Nina's polar bear is waiting for us there. We're going to sneak around that pile of rocks and head straight to the goal station. The first one's called This or That. So we'll take that goal. prospector. I'm looking for some rare ore. They look like pieces of rock with shiny bits on them. Based on your earlier work, seems like there should be some here in the quarry. A pay for each set of three you bring in. Ah, so this sounds like it's a repeatable goal. I do believe that we should try zapping some of the rocks because I think that's where we'll find the rare ore. And we left a pile of rocks up here when we went to the goal station. Sure enough, rare ore, one out of three. Oh, rare ore, two out of three. Oh, well, who would believe we would get three out of three anyway? So we'll continue zapping. And we know there's a dasher down here. So this one is probably pretty worked out. We'll try under the root just in case, but we're going to head to a different instance of the quarry and see if there's more rocks to zap. Here's a nice little pile. And if you get them wiggling beside each other, you can get bonus points by getting them at the same time. Well, howdy dowdy. That's a nice set you've got. And as I promised, your reward. Alright. So we found the rare ore. We can go back to the... Whoa! Those rocks kind of pop right up in your face. Alright, we can head back to the goal station and take that again anytime and get rewarded for finding three more of the rare ores. But today we saw another goal down there that we want to take a peek at. So let's run down to the goal station. And that dasher is still there. Chlorophytus. We'll take it. Oh, it's Esteban. This is an excellent habitat we have here, isn't it? He's curious about the organisms that could possibly live here. With such heat and aridness out in the desert, I'm sure there's something new and exciting hidden away in here. So, his chlorophyte scan indicates that there are high levels of one form of a new plant. So, that species should be here somewhere. He says, start by looking near the pollution. That seems to be where the readings are the most dense. Well, Nina's polar bear isn't that excited about fighting pollution. She likes these little rocks. Oh look! A gold nugget! We're going to hang on to the gold nuggets. You can find those in those rocks. And there will be a goal later where, we'll, where we will need to have gathered up ten gold nuggets. So it doesn't hurt that she's trying to build up her confidence level here. It wasn't for naught. Okay, Nina, are you feeling a little braver yet? No. Running past all the vileys. What have you got on your mind, girl? Well, she's going to take on the ten-eyed trashy. But of course she had to wait until she had no food or den. And is... Whoa! But she got it! Let me take a look at what he ha what you have. It's a specimen of high caliber. Woohoo! And 
Ah, this is the driest moss he's ever seen. And yes, we did find it attached to a chunk of pollution. Esteban says I, he imagines the pollution here has sucked all the moisture out of the area and the poor plant probably had to do that to survive. Now, we've been busy listening to Esteban and did a little happy dance. And while we were doing our happy dance, our happiness and energy meters went back to being smiley faces. So we got all the points for that one. So that was all right. Nina is worn out though, so we'll see you again next time on Let's Play Faunasphere. Thanks for joining us. Bye-bye.